Police Commissioner Michael Harrison says both the scenes here at Federal Hill and in Howard County are part of a domestic dispute. You can see here police tape still lining one of the homes here along the 1500 block of Marshall Street. Now we just learned minutes ago that the victim here at the Federal Hill location was supposedly the suspect's girlfriend. The woman killed in Howard County was his ex wife. The suspect first started here at this Federal Hill home. Harrison says officers were called slightly after 1 30 this afternoon to the 1500 block of Marshall Street and found the back door of one of these homes kicked in. Inside, they found that woman dead with apparent gunshot wounds. He said shortly after they received more information of another homicide in Columbia and police say just after 2 p.m. there, they went to the 7300 block of Edenbrook Drive for reports of gunshots. We are just learning now that a video post on social media said the suspect was headed towards Howard County. Baltimore police say they saw that video on Facebook, but by the time they made it there, it was already too late. That is where police say he shot and killed his ex wife before taking his own life. Neighbors gathering outside in the Federal Hill location learning the news had this to say. We're just in complete shock. I mean, this is a safe neighborhood and we feel so comfortable walking outside and we're just we just have no words. And police say they are working to notify the next of kin before releasing the identities of the people involved in this dispute. Both the police commissioner and Mayor Brandon Scott were here at the Federal Hill location. They were talking about how this violence is unacceptable, especially when it comes to solving issues. We'll also bring you more updates on this case tonight on 10 and 11. But for now, we're live here in Federal Hill tonight. I'm Amy Liu, WBAL TV 11 News.